it's me, Stom the Bean, and welcome back to some more Fallcraft. Yes, we are back here on the server, and today, nobody's on, which is good. I don't want anybody on. Um, but guys, if you want to come and join this server, all you have to do is head on over to Patreon. Uh, the link is in the description down below, and if you want to come and join the server, all you have to do is pledge the $5 tier or more, and uh, you will gain access to this server uh, along with everybody else, and you can come and build and uh, have some fun with us. Uh, yes, and also if you're still enjoying this series, then please do hit that like button down below. Also, if you're new to my channel, then please do subscribe to Daily Minecraft Videos. Right, it's time to get on with this episode. I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, right, okay, so uh, let's tell you what I've been doing off camera. Uh, let's just throw uh, all of that into there. I've got one of these, a Squeakinator. It um, it turns all of this stuff over here. Let's um, let's actually go and collect some because I can actually. Oh man. Uh, I can actually use use filling up with this stuff. Uh, do you have to? Uh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Um, yeah, the squeakinator. So if I grab all of these berries and things, which well, shouldn't take too long, uh, we just go along like so. I really don't like the rain. I I yeah, I find it very annoying. I really need to make a weather uh, uh, machine thing to stop stop the terrible weather. Um, yeah. So if we take all of this. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do for now. There's got to be a stack there. Yeah, there is. Uh, oh. Let's fly. Um, yeah, if we take all of this, and then if we go into... Oh, we put one of these here as well, so we can access it outside. If we uh, click on the juicer, uh, take that and make that, this thing should, if I'm correct, eat all of those up. Yes, it did. Uh, and now it will just feed me automatically, the whole time. It will just feed me. Can we make some more? Are you gonna, are you gonna swallow those up? There we go. And it will just constantly feed me. So whenever I need food, uh, it will, uh, it will, it will eat for me. Right. Another thing that I've done because obviously we had the quarry going. If you remember last episode, we've got a quarry in the Nether. Uh, which we'll go look at shortly, uh, and we've got this quarry here. I don't know how it's doing. In actual fact, look, I'm just gonna. The rain's got to go off. I'm sorry, the rain has to go off. Uh, so we're at 450 out of 675. If you remember, I set it up over here. Uh, you can see where I set it up all over here. Uh, to, yeah, I've ruined the terrain. Uh, but it finished that, and I moved it to somewhere else uh, because uh, I wanted to get more escalium. Now we're going to have a look and see how much Escalium I actually got. Uh, because Escalium, as you know, lets you build the Escalium reactor, which gives you free power. It's all passive. It generates itself. Uh, so it's definitely worth setting up. Uh, so if we type in Escalium, we've got 79 Escalium ore. Now we can double that easily, uh, maybe even triple it. I think we get 9 per. But Big Daddy J showed me a way to get even more, and I'll show you that shortly. Uh, we'll have to head over to his base. Um, yeah, so we've got that quarry running. Uh, so down here, obviously we've got... Oh, I should say I've got my all doubling all set up here. Uh, this is exactly the same system as what I had in Feed the Beast Beyond. Uh, it runs off of... Um, just all of these, let me just show you quickly. Uh, it runs off of these uh, conduits, and that is it. It's literally uh, every conduit uh, has a certain channel. So this one pulls out on brown, and then in here it's inserted it on brown, and then it extracts on blue. This inserts on blue and then extracts on purple, and this one inserts on purple. Uh, so, yeah, it just basically takes everything out and um, and sets it all up, and it's, it's all good. It's all good. It works perfectly, and obviously... Um, did I... Did I lose them? Did, did you take them? You did. That's not fair. Um, right, so let's put this back like that. So obviously, every 
ore goes into here once it's smelted down out of these go wow you've stopped why have you stopped oh because you're still not running i need to upgrade these guys put some octodic capacitors in there uh but yeah ingots get put back into the rs system obviously this is still generating coal for me um and we have 165 <laughs> levels uh another thing that i've done now, if you remember a couple of episodes ago, uh, I can't remember who it was. I think it was one Matto uh, gave me near on a thousand Never Stars, and I said, "Should I use them?" And a lot of you said, "Yeah, take them." Somebody said, "Take a stack." Other people said, "No, don't cheat." But you know, this is a server. We're a community, and we help each other out. So I took them, and um, I made them into something. Power generation. Um, yeah, I'm using Neverstar generators to generate the power I need to actually get my quarries running. Um, ow. Yeah, that's, that's not a good thing. And up here you can see, because I finally made a Yeta wrench. Uh, this is my output and input. It's exactly the same. Uh, this thing is full to the brim. And, uh, I'm able to run my quarry and everything else that I need to run just using those Neverstars. And obviously power from here. Please don't kill me! Oh, I thought it was going to kill me. Uh, that's supposed to eat for me. You're not eating for me. I'm not happy. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it in terms of things that I've done. Um, yeah, that that is it. So today's episode is um, it's going to be a bit of an odd one, really. I was going to um, get set up for Woot and stuff like that. But um, I have presents to open once more. Um, and, uh, yeah, I, I already know who this is from, but I don't know what's in there. Uh, so, and I'm going to pronounce your name wrong. It's Athantheus. Athanasius44 says, Hey Stomp, thought that it was time for you to start a little farm. So in this bag or holding, bag of holding, are some seeds and items that should help you on your way. Cool. It is about time I started doing some farming. So what we got in here then? Oh, nice. Really? Draconium Nether Guardian what's Guardian? Quartz enriched iron seeds. Iron se steel seeds. Diamond seeds. Gold seeds. Vibrant alloy. Lapis Enderium Coal with a skeleton in Ethereum seeds, chicken seeds, dirt, zombie, wood, solarium, nature, and ice. And then we have an octodic capacitor, a reinforced watering can, a farming station, and a grave crystal. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. Oh yes, thank you very much. I am going to take those. I am, I, I'm taking them. I am taking them. Um, the question is, where will I set them up? Hmm. That is a tough question. I, I, I could do a... Oh, no, because it's um, 15 by 15, is it? I think. So I could make a like, like a nice little 15 by 15 area up here for all my farming stuff that I've just been gifted. I think that's a good idea. I think we should get this going. Give me a few minutes, and I'll be back shortly. Okay, so I've got it all set up now. Um, yeah, it's ready to go. I've got it all, all wired up. And what I've used is fertilized dirt here. And then we've got um, just normal dirt here because I don't have um, enough seeds to run. I mean, I don't even know if I need the, the octardic capacitor in this. We'll see. We'll see. I'll just leave this like this for now. But this will run perfectly. Um, and there we go. Look, we got some zombie essence just popped up there. Because I've got the growth, uh, the tier the tier 1 growth pulsar down there. Um, so that's going to help them grow anyway. So that's going to start getting me some essence. Uh, although I haven't got much. It's only been running for a moment. But if we type in ESS uh, essence. Yeah, there we go. We've got some lapis, some dye, zombie, uh, vibrant. We're doing all right. It's pretty cool. Right. So the other thing we got to do is we got to head on over to Big Daddy Jay's house. So let's get our Iscalium. Uh, we've now got 80. Nice. Uh, we'll take this. 
And um, uh, yeah, let's let's go over to there. Let me just talk to Big Daddy Jenny, uh, Big Daddy Jenny, Big Daddy J. Uh, hey, bud, recording. Can I borrow your armor for Iscalium? Please. There we go. Let's uh, let's see what he says. Hopefully he says yes, and we can pop over there and um, yeah, go and borrow his stuff, uh, which would be kind of cool. And then uh, then we've got a little bit of revenge for Big Danny J. So we're gonna go over and steal his stuff, and then then we're gonna take revenge on him for what he did to us. With our of course, I'm just crafting blocks, which takes forever. Come on by. I'm I'm here, mate. I'm here. I was here ages ago. Uh, right, here we are. Uh, let it all load in then, please. Uh, there we go. Okay. So, uh, you might notice when we get to Big Daddy J's house, as soon as the lag stops, please. All right, let's just let it all load in. Let it all load in. There we go. That's better. Right, we can go down now. As soon as we get to Big Daddy J's house, in the top left-hand corner, uh, you can see, is that is that the emerald armor? I think it is. Emerald chest plate is lucky. There we go. Um, you can see we're getting luck uh, in the top corner there. You can see that. Oh, uh, no, I, w I want that, please. Thank you. Did he, did he, uh, I should be able to just do that, right? Uh, <laughs> just give me that back. No! I've never used an armor stand, ever. What? What? Hold on a second. What's happened there? What is that all about? Uh, that that's weird. Okay, well, um, this is what's going to happen then. So we're going to take some Iscalium. Now, if you remember last time, I think it was using our current pickaxe, uh, we got. Please tell me that's. Dude, your base is like messed up. No, no, you're you're stealing my. I don't want to swap Iscalium for this, please. I, I'm, I'm not happy with this. Is it render distance causing an issue? I mean, it is very laggy here for some reason. Can I can I now place? Please don't, don't. No! I'll just go home. I'll just, I'll just go home. Because there's quite clearly something wrong with his base. I won't go home. I'll go over here. I'll, I'll go over here. This will do. This will do. Right. Thank you. Right. Now, when we break this without the emerald armor on, uh, we we get, I think it was nine. Now, if we break it this time, I can't tell you because <laughs> it all goes back into the system. Um, but I believe we had 50. I'm pretty sure, yeah, we had 50. Um, so we'll find out by going home how many Escalion we just got from just breaking that. I wanted to do it at his base because he has luck um, over there. But I'm losing out on Escalium ore, which is not good. Although I think it's just come back to me now. But I still do have that spare emerald leggings. I don't get what that's all about. That's not supposed to happen. Wow, if it's laggy at his base now, you wait until I do what I'm going to do to him. <laughs> I can't wait. Um, right, let's um, let's head over there. Um, in actual fact, now we've stolen his stuff. Um, I might I might set up. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to show you uh, what it is I'm going to do to get him back. Because... It, it makes it more interesting. It's going to take a little bit of time anyway. 
uh, for what I want to do. So let's um, let's do that. Right. So um, yes, let's uh, let's break this little hole here. Is it this one? No. Okay. Uh, I need to remember where I put it. I think it's this one. No. All right. So that means it's is this one. Um. Ah oh, yes, we're getting there now. What's what's with the weird? Where, where's it gone? It should be here. <gasps> no. Please. Here. Aha! <laughs> That was lucky. So, what we've got here is we have a builder. Yes, we do. We have a builder with an advanced power cell next to it because, well, let's be honest, I stole his power again. <laughs> and in here, we have basalt, or whatever you want to call it. I don't care. It's, it's basalt or whatever. <laughs> Um, I have got this set up so that when it, it starts building, oh dear, the lag is real. It's going to build this over Big Danny J's base. Oh yes, it is. Uh, now I should really go and switch it off because you can probably see that. Uh, well, it's tough because it's about to happen. So all I've got to do is put this here and turn this on. And we're going to start building. Watch all that fly out of there. And it's going to fill up because I've got stack upgrades in there. Let's see whether we can see this being built. Um, please. Please be built. Please. Now, uh, if Big Daddy J does watch this and see that I've stole his power, um, uh, they're my power cells. I'm not telling you how I've stole your power. All I can say is, thank you very much for the free power. Right, is this being built anywhere? Where's the location? Come on, I need to see this. I I set this up yesterday. I've been so desperate to get it all going. Come on, where where are you being built? Show me. I mean, it's huge. It is huge. It's going to cover his entire base. It'll put his entire base in darkness. But I can't see it. Where are you? Okay, it's not out here. As long as it doesn't destroy his base, I'll be okay. Ah, what's that? Oh no, that's his base. Do, 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 do. Hmm, okay, I'm going to hunt around and try and find it because I don't want to... Ah. Is that? No. No. I, I am going to hunt around and try and find where it's being built. Um, because I don't want to waste time on this video. Uh, we've still got so much to do. So give me a few minutes. And I'll be back shortly. Okay, so I found it. This is where it's being built. I had to put the uh, preview on just to see. But look, all these mobs are spawning on top. Oh dear. Oh no. No, please don't shoot me. Uh, it is building very slowly, but it is doing it. Uh, can we see it happening? We can certainly see Big Daddy J's base just down there. Oh man, the lag is so real just because there's this massive structure and um, it's just getting built all around his base. Is it is it building over this end then maybe? Let's go and have a look. I don't know. I don't know where it's building. I know it is. I know it's happening because Obviously, that's being done. Uh, it's going to take a while, and it's going to lag the server like crazy, but it's totally worth it. It is totally worth it. Um, but yeah, right. Anyway, I'm going to turn that off. I'm going to leave that going. We'll come back to that later. Um, after after Big Danny J's been nice enough to let me borrow his uh, stuff, I'm still going to um, still going to do this. It's happening. Right, let's get back down into here. Turn that preview off. So, well, he's going to see it. There's no two ways about it. He's going to see it, but there's nothing he can... <laughs> 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 
That was not fair. That was not fair. Right, uh, there's nothing he can do about it, really, unless he knows where the builder is, and he'll have to go around looking for it. Good luck to him. Um, right, so let's head back over to our base, where the lag is not real, and... Um, yeah, we can uh, we can actually get started on um, turning this escalium into uh, stuff. So I said we had 50 originally, right? Um, I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Let's have a look now. Escalium, 59. So we only get 9. No, that can't be right. 9 per. I was getting 9 per last time. Ow, I've just hit my mic. Let me test that out again. So we got 59 now. We got 10 that time. Sixteen. So it's very it's very random. It is very random. Okay, well, let's just smash through all of this. Uh, maybe I'm not doing it right. I don't know, but we've got quarries running. We're going to have my quarry running uh, all the time. So I'm not too worried about it. I'm just going to grab all of this and vein mine the lot, I think. Uh, there we go. Is that it? That can't be it, surely. Okay, well, there's vein mine. Well, we're getting a lot of luck. <laughs> Look at all that! Oh my god! We have so much! Wow! One point five K of Escalium ore. Can you imagine the size of the reactor that I'm going to be making with that? That's just insane. That is insane. Um, right, anyway, I wanted to just show you that uh, I think it was one Matto left this for me. Um, as nice as it is, yeah, it's time for you to take a chance, you dirty thief. Um, it's too close to my base. I can't open that too close to my base. Surely that's not a good thing to do. And he's left all these chance cubes as well. I mean... I can't. I can't. So my only option is to void it with the builder. But I'll leave it down to you guys. What would you prefer I did? Um, right, okay. Let's head to the nether for my last thing because I like to finish my videos in the nether. Um, let's head to the nether because I just want to check on my quarry out there. Um, I've just... Uh, oh, I've just set that up. And um, yes... I did add um, um, an ender chest to it so that I could start claiming all my stuff. Uh, so let's just go in there and check on it and um, make sure it's all running okay. Uh, it's here, isn't it? Well, that was Big Daddy Jane. It's the power company. Well, that's what I think of the power company. I just got luck from hitting him with that as well. Wow, I need to get me a set of these. Uh, that is still running though, right? Yeah, that's still running. That's still... That's currently mining. Yeah, and we're getting all of that. That's good. Right. So, uh, why Balsalt? You may ask, why did I want to make uh, Big Daddy J's house out of foul sand, or whatever you want to call it? I'll tell you why. Because I have so much junk from all this quarrying I've been doing. Basalt, or basalt, whatever you want to call it. I don't even know what it's called. I have 137,000 of it. And I don't want it. i got no use for it whatsoever. I think you can chisel it. I don't know. Let's have a look. Um, I think you can chisel it. It's from chisel. Dang it. I just hit my mic again. Um, yeah. Into that. That's disgusting. 
I don't like it. I don't, it's not a very nice block. I want it to go. And uh, there's a good way of getting rid of it. And that is making it build around Big Daddy J's house. <laughs> let's go and check on it and see whether it's done yet. I don't think it will be, but let's just go and have a look and see if it's actually starting expanding uh, anywhere near where I've um, put the quarry. It doesn't appear to be just yet. Um, so what I'm going to do, guys, is I am going to go AFK for a bit. I'm going to let this thing build all over his base. And then I'm going to come back and show you once it's all finished. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so a really, really, really long time ago, uh, we started doing this. Uh, it's not quite gone to plan. I, well, I'll show you. I had a hundred and something thousand blocks of basalt. I've run out of blocks. So I'm going to have to leave it going. But look at this. Look at this. It is almost finished. It is almost complete. And I get so much lag when I go this way. So much lag. It's all in darkness. There's only a few spots of light. Look at this. It is everywhere. This is amazing. A Big Daddy J is going to have to break all this down. And end up with a hundred and something thousand of it. I thought there'd be enough. Quite clearly there wasn't. But it's all over his base. His base is in complete darkness. And um, the lag's not too bad actually. I thought it was going to be a lot worse than this. I think his base creates more lag uh, than this structure. Um, but yeah, I wish I could have made it lower, but there was just no way using the builder, uh, to get it to go any lower. Um, but yeah, this is cool. This is real cool. I like it. That will teach him to mess with me. Stealing my stuff and locking it away and things like that. This is where it got to and it didn't finish. So it's like, it's, it's completely covered his base. But there is like this, just this area that isn't done. I probably need about another like 50,000 blocks uh, to use <laughs> to finish it off. Um, but I left him a message. And uh, I'll leave this running. This can run um, all, all night now uh, because my quarry is running. So as long as I've got uh, Balsalt coming in, I can't, I can't pronounce this thing. Uh, then um, it, it can be alright. But I just put, hey dude, I was worried about your windows getting dirty, so I built you a big umbrella. Enjoy. <laughs> it's pretty cool, right? I mean, you have to have massive render distance to see the whole thing, but... And as you can see, I've, I've got it nice and close to his, uh, his tier... I think this is a tier 8, isn't it? Is it a tier 8? Tier 6. Um energy core so it's not in interfering with anything at least anyway because it's all in good fun um but yes guys um that is going to be it for this episode if you did enjoy please do hit that like button down below also if you're new to my channel then please do subscribe for daily minecraft videos uh please do tell all your friends about the channel and all that great stuff because it really does help out a lot and um yes uh if you want to come and join the server uh all you got to do is head on over to patreon um, the link is in the description down below, and if you pledge the $5 tier or more, you will gain access to this server and any other servers that I'm running currently. Um, so yeah, you can do that if you want to. Um, but thank you very much for watching. I've been Stomp the Bean. This has been Fullcraft. <laughs>